And welcome, everybody, to the MJ and Ty podcast show. Today is May 20th of 2021. So, before we begin, Timer has, uh, has some uh, things that he'd like to talk to you guys, guys about right now. All right. So, we put out a poll last... Friday, I would say, didn't we? Last Friday or Thursday? We put out a poll for you guys on Twitter to vote if you guys want us to live stream. And some of the votes went up. Some of the votes went down. So I'm about to tell y'all the poll. Um, 100% say yes to the live streams and for the no's zero percent went down awesome so it looks like we're doing some live streams then you yep. it looks like all right let's jump into it no go ahead okay mr pinocchio had a... all right Gandalf. So, our first topic uh, is who is the most underrated player in the NFL and who is the most overrated player in the NFL? Um, that's an excellent question. Most overrated? Well, it's definitely not Tom Brady. Probably not Patrick Mahomes either. Nor nor Rogers. Hmm. And no, I'm not going to say Odell Beckham Jr. I do not believe that guy is overrated and. He's he's a beast of a talent. He's got a beast of a talent, despite what Mayfield's numbers may say with him on the field. Uh, if I had to, if I had to give my pure, honest opinion. I don't think there are very very many overrated players in the NFL today. It just seems that it it just seems like uh, most of them are um, perfectly rated, in my opinion. And uh, yeah, I I really don't have any. Uh, players that are that I can think of that are over overrated underrated um, though um, underrated I don't think uh, this guy is that underrated, but I do really like uh, Jedrick Wills, uh, despite him being a, being a, in his second year in the NFL. He did he did make some mistakes last year, but he was a rookie, and the NFL eats rookies alive most of the time. So I think his I think his blocking ability is can more more than make up for. Um, for this and uh, he just what he just wasn't a very he just wasn't a very talk talked about uh, when he was a prospect he, he just wasn't very he wasn't talked about very much uh, all right ty oh my my yeah. players in my opinion yeah so Overrated, I would say is I wouldn't put you know 
I wanted to say Baker, then my opinion changed on that. Um, you would say Baker is overrated? My opinion changed over that, okay? Okay? There's two different things. People can change their decision. Well, I'm not denying it. You just look like very hype. Very disappointed once I said it. But I was but, just surprised. But and a little bit of, let, and a little bit disappointed. Let me get back to my point. I would say um Teddy but Teddy Bridgewater is overrated. Okay. Because yeah. he has been probably on six different teams, five different teams, whatever. And oh. he's not he's not the most quarterback talked about in the NFL. Or the most player not talked about in the NFL. Yeah. Um underrated I would have to say is Antonio Brown. Really? And Antonio Brown, the diva. <laughs> he is kind of a diva. Oh, he, like he used can, to be. A, he used to be, especially can, when you consider it, especially when you, when you throw in the fact that he, he had all those legal troubles. Yep. Yeah, yep. Bruce Arians still took a chance on him and won a Super Bowl. Yep. I think he needed that chance, but here's the thing. A.B. is a good receiver. It's like a good receiver. Might be in the Hall of Fame one day. Um, But when you look at it, you got to look at it as, okay, um, this dude went down, had problems with Pittsburgh, had problems playing for the Patriots. I mean, it didn't work out with the Patriots. It he didn't hated, work out. He hated his tenure for with the with the Raiders. Don't forget that. He did he didn't like the Raiders. I was going to get to that, Pinocchio. Your nose is getting so big. I never told a lie. I didn't tell a lie right there. My nose if I'm Pinocchio, my my nose can't grow and when I don't tell a lie. Your nose is going to grow more as a giraffe. My but nose is going to grow point. more than a giraffe. Look it up. Okay. okay. But AB, I think he finally found a place that he likes to play in Tampa. But none of I think a lot of, you know, fans that that I said their favorite team will get mad at me um, for saying that. But I think he found the right place to play, and he's underrated to me. Like, other people can say otherwise. All right. What do you have Aaron Rodgers as quarterback over Lamar Jackson or Patrick Mahomes? Or uh, out of these three quarterbacks, which would you rather have at the helm? Aaron Rodgers, Lamar Jackson, or Patrick Mahomes? Hmm. At this moment, Mahomes, if we're talking about Rodgers and his prime, maybe Rodgers uh, at that point. I'd, I'd say he'd probably be pretty even with Mahomes. Uh, and uh, Lamar Jackson, uh, if you if you can shut down uh, Lamar Jackson's running game somehow, you're going to win that game because – because he, he 
overly relies it on on his uh, running game and, and his and his throwing games. I don't want to say it's trash, but it's eh, kind of close to that. Kind of close to that. And like a running quarterbacks hardly ever pan out that that well in, in the NFL. Especially once they get to old, once once they start to age and slow down. Again, look at Colin Kaepernick. He was a running quarterback, and, and he sucked to five. And he sucked five years into his tenure in the NFL. Oh come on! He wasn't that bad. He wasn't that bad. He was a bench warmer. Hey, he wasn't that bad. When he was first starting out and running all over the place. But then teams figured out how to stop, how to slow him down. All right. Is also, take- also another example is Robert Griffin the third. Well, he got he got slowed down by injuries, but still. All right. All right. All right. So I was here listening to your take. Did you see me listening to your take? Yeah. Okay, because I was very interested what you just said a moment ago. Now, I'm going to top that because I always top your take after mine, and we all know it. In your mind, yes. But not in, in my real mind. World, in the real world. Not, and what, not in my mind. Was that, was that the, all right, viewers. Let, tell us in the comment section down below who gives the, the better takes. <laughs> you me, really going to ask that. Me, Mark, or Ty? <laughs> I knew we were going to get this type of Mark today. Um, but what's that? What's that mean? What's that have to do with anything? You're saying but, I'm not. You're saying I'm not my normal normal self today, Ty. Um, I thought we were going to get mad, Mark, where you get where you were mad at the baseball topic. But let me get to something straight up. Yeah. Is that? Is that? I think I would take Patrick Mahomes. Okay. Over. Over. Lamar Jackson and um I agree with that one. Over Lamar Jackson and um Aaron Rodgers. Like there's no combate over that. There's no combate over that. Yes, people can have combates about that and say probably they'll take Aaron Rodgers, but probably in a couple of years. We'll come back and visit this topic and say, oh, look how Mahomes, you know, career turned out, how um, Lamar Jackson's career turned out, and then we might talk about this again. But now, now it's the easy factor. I would take Patrick Mahomes over Lamar Jackson, like, we might change our minds after this season. We don't know. Right. Because players prove stuff every single year. Right. So what are, like, right now, I would take Patrick Mahomes. Not... Yeah, like Lamar's a great runner with the ball. Um, but you gotta look who has a championship. Yep. All right. That's gonna do it for today's episode. Thank you all so much for paying attention to us uh, opinionated people. <laughs> If you, you really going to say that? You really going to say that? Well, it's true. We are opinionated 
I know, I know. I thought you were going to say something else. Anyways, leave a like and drop a comment. Tweet it. Send a send a Twitter bird tweet our way or something. Tell us if you're ready for the live streams. Those won't happen for another couple months, though. Yeah, they won't happen until the next couple months. Yeah. All right. See you all next week. Keep your head in the game. Uh, yada, 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 yada. Goodbye. 